You want ceramic coat on your Model Y at home. You've come to the right place. This is Avalon King Armor Shield 9. I'm Adam. I've got 20 years experience hand washing cars. This video is not sponsored. If you'd like to support the channel, hit subscribe. Here's what's in the box. A shiny thank you card, an applicator card, we'll get to that later, one bottle of Armor Shield 9, an applicator sponge, a super soft microfiber towel, your suede coating applicator cloth and a glove, and the instructions. Let's get straight to them. We are going to go with the optimal method. However, I won't be doing a paint correction or polish today because I don't think my car needs it right now. First, we'll wash the vehicle. And today, I'm just focusing on the paint. If you want to see a full exterior wash of a Model Y, I'll put a link in the description. I'm also using Avalon King Prep Shampoo, which is neutral pH and strips away old wax and sealants. After that, I'm doing a bucket wash with a clean new microfiber towel. The best deal in my area is AutoZone, $29.99 for 50. I only do one bucket. I know this is controversial. I don't dip the towel, I scoop the soap. Watch this video for more on that, link below. Now we rinse with the pressure washer. No need to dry because after the microfiber wash and pressure rinse, I'm stripping the rest of the contaminants off with a clay bar. It's Meguiar's. These are good for any color and can do 10 to 15 cars. This is a tedious process, but it's really effective on getting all the way down to the clear coat. Here's some contaminants. I've got a spray bottle to keep the surface lubricated as I move along the car with the clay bar. Mine is just water. People also use soap, and there's way more than one way to do this correctly. More on that in a minute. As long as the surface is lubricated and you don't feel a drag on the clay bar, you're doing it right. Next, we dry the surface to prevent water spots. And it's the same procedure with the rear and the panels on the other side. But with this side, I'll skip the pressure rinse before the clay bar, which you can do if the vehicle isn't very dirty. This car was clean just a few days ago, so I'll be okay. I'm continuing Continuing to utilize the spray bottle so my clay bar glides across the paint and I'm kneading the clay regularly to prevent redistributing contamination on the clear coat surface. Next we'll get to the front and dry it off. Then we pull the car into the garage for an IPA wipe. We want a cool paint surface. IPA is isopropyl alcohol, not a tasty small batch refreshment. This cleans up everything that was left behind from the car wash, clay bar, and drying. Oh, and you see that ugly nasty yellow PPF? I swapped that out in an upcoming video. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss it. Okay, wash steps complete. Time to apply the ceramic coating. Here's the breakdown. Work in a well-ventilated area. I'm in my garage with the door open. I'm still wearing a mask because this stuff has a strong smell and it's also recommended. Make sure the body surface is cool. Like we said before, have a flashlight to inspect the coating. Add drops as needed to keep the applicator cloth damp and smooth on application. Drying and curing times will vary, but heat speeds up this process. Keep that in mind. And swap towels if the material hardens. On to the steps. First, we're wrapping the applicator cloth around the sponge and using that included card to secure it. Then we're going to shake and apply the coating to the cloth. Spread thick layers in a crisscross pattern, adding drops frequently. Let it sit till it flashes, shown here. Once you see the rainbow, it's time to wipe it off. And that's it. Now we're going to move around the vehicle, apply the coating, wait for it to flash, and remove it with the microfiber towel. So this is about 30 days later, and I wanted to wait this amount of time just so you can see how long this ceramic coating really holds up. And what I've done is the paint and the black trim all the way around the lower part of the car. This isn't a fresh clean, it's just what it looks like on a regular basis when you head out with some ceramic coating. Now I do clean it regularly, but the cleaning is much more simple now that the ceramic coating has been applied. I only use two things to wash the car, and that's a pressure washer and this Ammo Hydrate Pro. 
along with some microfiber towels. Subscribe if you want to see that video, it's coming soon. But the paint is super hydrophobic, and I hope this helps you realize how important and easy it is to apply a ceramic coating to the paint of a car you love. Let me know any questions you have down in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, and hit subscribe. Plenty more videos on the way.